8 Ways to Eliminate Abdominal Bloating Are you experiencing abdominal bloating and don't know how to get rid of the problem? Today, we want to give you a set of recommendations that will help you alleviate this problem quickly and easily. 1. Massages for Reducing Gas Sometimes, you suffer from bloating due to a buildup of gas. Fortunately, in such cases you can avoid the problem with a simple massage. What should you do? Place four fingers horizontally over the center of your abdomen. The point beneath your index finger is exactly what you're looking for. Once you have located the area, perform a gentle massage for 2 to 3 minutes in a clockwise direction. You'll know you're doing it right because it will actually increase your production of saliva. 2. Massage to fight fluid retention. If you're trying to reduce the amount of fluid retained in your tissues that can make your abdomen look swollen, a simple massage will make that task easier. What should you do? Once again, use your navel as a reference point for this massage. What you're looking for is about two finger widths above it. You need to apply some pressure on this area and massage it for 2 to 3 minutes in a clockwise direction, and then reverse. 3. Massage to increase intestinal activity. This next massage will help you increase the activity of your intestine and avoid constipation, which can be one of the causes of abdominal bloating. What should you do? This time, you want to focus on the area about four finger widths below the navel and massage it for two to three minutes in a clockwise direction, then reverse. This simple motion will help promote peristaltic contractions. In addition to relieving constipation, it will help with abdominal swelling. 4. Drink water with lemon juice. Did you know that drinking a glass of warm water with lemon juice 15 to 20 minutes before breakfast will help regulate your production of stomach acids and alleviate any symptoms of heartburn? This solution will eliminate burping and prevent the formation of gases in your intestines. In addition, it's a great source of vitamin C. 5. Skip the latte at breakfast. Coffee with milk is one of the most common breakfast beverages. If you're trying to preserve the health of your digestive system, however, you should forget this drink and order something healthier. Keep in mind that milk stimulates the production of stomach acids. Coffee has a similar effect as milk in the stomach, so together the increase in acidity is even worse. What should you do? If you can go without a little dairy in the morning, you can substitute yogurt for milk. This way, you get healthy bacteria for digesting your food. 6. Come don't drink alcohol on an empty stomach. Remember that alcoholic beverages also stimulate the production of stomach acids. This is a problem when your stomach is empty, because it slows the work of the stomach itself and damages the walls of this organ. If you drink alcohol on a regular basis, 
You should also be aware that it kills the microflora in your stomach and intestines. The best thing to do is to drink alcohol in moderation, and always with a little food in your stomach. 7. Eliminate fatty foods from your diet. Eating fatty foods on a regular basis is something to be avoided at all costs. Try to remember that fatty foods like fast food and sugary desserts are heavy and can slow down your digestion. The harder it is for your body to digest, the more gas it produces. If you want to avoid the heaviness and discomfort associated with this type of food, we recommend you follow a more balanced diet with plenty of fruits and vegetables. Your body will definitely notice the change. 8. Eat foods with fiber, but in moderation. High fiber foods are a great option, but be careful not to overdo it. Be sure to get your recommended daily dose of fruits, vegetables, berries, and legumes, but without sliding into excess. Too much fiber can actually cause more gas production and bloating. It can even slow down the function of your intestines. 